Hello and welcome back. Uh, today I have an os oscilloscope. It's an old one, analog one. It's from uh, Trio. It can do 20 megahertz, uh, and it just came with some other stuff that I uh, that I bought. And it doesn't have his arm anymore in both sides. It doesn't have a stand to to tilt it, uh, but it's supposed to still work. So. Uh, we're gonna see if it works, and if it does, then we're gonna open it and clean it and everything. Well, as you can see, it uh, has had better days, and it's really full of dirt, so it uh, probably came from an attic. And all the switches, they feel like they work, but they all have some sort of grease. So I think they try to do something with contact cleaner. And all the buttons, as you can see, are full, full of dust or sand. So we're gonna try to clean that. But first, we're gonna see if it uh, powers on. Oh, I connected the power. So uh, just uh, have a look. Uh, I will tilt it a little bit. So maybe you have a little bit of a better view. Uh, power on. It does power on. I don't see too much yet, so maybe we need to put more intensity. Oh, it's very dark. Let's put everything to zero. Nah, maybe it needs a little bit. Ah, here, look, 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 there it comes. put uh, some signal here what does that do do we see something put on uh, DC ah we have something put a little focus Okay, position. Well, it does seem to work. But as you can see, all the contacts are really, are really dirty. And uh, let's see the second channel. Sync on the second channel. Let's see what is it not doing. That is not the, that is my first channel then. Yeah. I must say, these uh, new digital scopes work a lot more uh, easy because here you really need to see, okay, what mode I want, mode 1, mode 2, let's do them both, let's add, so if we do both, let's see if we move here, the position, we can move a bit, if we change the but then the sync needs to be on the other channel and then we can maybe lift this one and lift that one but it does sync uh, pretty nice well that all seems to work um, now we're just gonna open it and uh, see what the inside looks like Now look at this, this, the tube is huge. That's why the machine is that big, because in the, the electronics is not that much, not even that it's so uh, old. 
and a lot of mechanical switching uh, right there so you probably need to use the contact cleaner in and uh, yeah the power supply down there here all the timing control let's spin that around And I'm actually surprised that it looks this modern, so maybe it's not that old. Well, it's analog, but it, it, still. Look at this, the result. We uh, clean everything, all the switches are also clean and it without any distortion it just switch. I am happy with this. Such a difference. So that's it. Another nice looking Orsoliscope. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time.